Serious lah. Nah. Hey guys, welcome to episode 3 of Noise Stuff. Awesome. Uh, we would like to start our episode with a bit of a tribute to Kyoto Animation. Uh, it was such a tragedy, so our thoughts and prayers are with them. I, I am also wearing this Mio Akiyama t-shirt. Yeah. Nice. M my wife who right there, man. <laughs> Your wife who. Yeah. yeah. We just hope mm. that they can recover, the, re recover from this tragedy strong. Anyways, mm. um, for the first time ever, we hope this episode will have uh, uh, super decent, nice audio. decent audio. We, we <laughs> fucked it up for the first two episodes. We are deeply sorry. I mean, we've got several <laughs> comments from you guys and we are thankful because yep. critiques, comments, I mean, those are good. I mean, mm. it, it helps us... Uh, Grow, you know, uh, grow and, and learn. Learn. We yes. learn from our mistakes, yes. and uh, <laughs> it, it helps us, you know, create better content in the future. Brain fart. So, anyways, um, my crotch. What are we? Your <laughs> brain fart. What are we gonna do today? Ooh, today we're gonna talk about Area Fifty One. The Area Fifty One <laughs> raid. Yeah. Uh, I know. I know. We're probably we're probably coming into this topic. Kind of late. It's been it's been going on for a lot, for th two three weeks. Yeah, now? two three weeks already. The yeah. memes are around and about. Yeah, so it's on the news. <laughs> it's on the news. There are memes. Uh, there are comments. There are Twitter uh, threads about it. There are, yeah. It's everywhere. We know. It's everywhere. The only difference is between the both of us is that I'm not hyped up for it. I don't fucking care about Dude, the Area 51 but, raid. But it's so awesome. We got we got the Naruto runners right in the front. Yeah, and I and saw a meme on that. Uh, was it a Twitter uh, tweet or something like that? It's like uh -huh. someone saying, um, uh, the, the, funny, the funniest thing about this whole Area 51 raid is that who, someone had, will have to explain to the general or whoever oh, yeah. that's in charge at Area 51 <laughs> yes, yes, yes. that they had to explain to these guys what the Naruto run is. <laughs> Yeah, I saw that. I saw yeah, that picture. It's a, it's an, uh, it's and a, then it's that a, yeah. that army guy was actually demonstrating how it, how it works. Hilarious. I mean, <laughs> there are some 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 stuff that I can laugh about, but one thing that I cannot get over is why. Brain fart. Why not? I mean, why not? We're gonna okay. go inside there. This we're gonna we're gonna yolo. save the aliens, man. You know, is like ET. E. This is that whole YOLO shit, is it? <laughs> I guess so. All right. <laughs> They're gonna save the aliens, gonna get all the cute anime girls out of there, you know? Okay, all the you're fucking excited about it, why? Is that, is that your reason? Yeah. Saving the aliens and stuff like that? Yeah, saving alien chicks. Hashtag save alien chicks. Hashtag save, save alien chicks. Brain fart! <laughs> this episode is for you Malaysians mm. who have plans to head over to Area 51 for the raid. I'm not sure if it even happened yet. I'm not sure. No, it's in September. It's in September. <laughs> yeah, I'm not sure if they're gonna be like an event thing, event ticket that you have to buy or whatever. But here's the thing, whatever it is, those from Malaysia, if you wanna head over to Area 51 raid, obviously you have to be in Nevada first. You have to have like a bit of a pocket money. You have to pack, right? Yeah. So this is what we're gonna do. We're just gonna, <laughs> we're, we're just nice enough today to help you out to figure out um, how much do you have to set aside. It's, uh, it's towards the, the end of July now. Mm -hmm. So it's in September when? I'm not sure. You're not sure, sometime yeah. in September. So you have the whole of August <laughs> to save for this freaking event. Yeah. So we're gonna help you out. We're gonna, the laptop is on right now. So we're gonna go quickly <laughs> uh, to go through these. There are, there are several things that we need to check. We need to check your flight. How much is it that you have to set aside? And I think we're gonna just check uh, the flight to Nevada. Because chances are you're not gonna make it back home. Hey, we're gonna make it back home. We're gonna party in Vegas with uh, our alien chicks. Which yeah. is why it's a one-way ticket. <laughs> so, we, uh, but we're gonna check um, the return flight as well. Why not? Yeah. And we're gonna check for you how much you have to set aside in terms of pocket money. All right. All right. So we're gonna do two things for you today. Pocket so, money for Vegas as well. Woo. Brain fart. Flights to Nevada. Okay. <laughs> Flights Nevada. Okay, oh, so um, I'm on skyscanner.com.my. Flights Nevada. It's search for cheap flights. Sweet. Yeah, so from Kuala Lumpur, any flights. Uh -huh. We're gonna check return flights first. 
Kuala Lumpur to Nevada. Okay, let's just pick a date in September. Uh, maybe like let's no, like fifth or something. Okay, uh, assume okay. Fifth September is on a Thursday. Do you think the raid is gonna happen on a working day? Oh, it's probably gonna be a weekend. It's huh? probably a weekend, right? So assuming maybe okay. Thursday is good. You have you because it's a long flight, so you're probably gonna arrive on a Friday. Friday. So we uh -huh. choose a fifth of September as a departure. <laughs> And let's say you're gonna go home, right? So let's say the raid is gonna happen on, <laughs> on a weekend, Saturday <laughs> right. and Sunday. Yeah. Okay, let's go for a week stay in the US. All right. All right. <laughs> okay, provided that we haven't even, we, what we're not gonna check for you is that the, uh, the, uh, the cost of visa. We're not gonna check that for you. You figure it out. <laughs> we're gonna figure out for you the flight and the pocket money that you have, you have to set, set aside. So for one adult. Direct flights only? You want any layover? Nah, let's go straight. straight. Direct flights yeah. only. Yeah, direct flights only. <sighs> Brain fart. No direct, oh, no direct results. Oh man. Okay, so, okay, then. so it's one stop. Get prices, I guess. All right, let's go to yeah, get, prices. get prices. Las Vegas, prices. Nevada. Yeah. Whoa. Okay, okay that, that's a lot of so money. That's a lot of money. <laughs> You're still thinking of going over? For 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 the alien chicks, man. Brain fart. Uh, because Skyscanner would search through all uh, the available air airlines, and then they're gonna list it out. I think it's from the cheapest to the most expensive, depending on your needs. Uh, by the way, we're not <laughs> we're not we're not sponsored by Skyscanner.com.my. <laughs> This is gonna be like a feature of every of our yeah. episode. We're not, we're not sponsored. We're by not anyone. sponsored, but it would be nice if Skyscanner could sponsor us tickets to okay. Vegas. Brain fart. So on the first, the topmost here, we have um, it's a United Airlines. I think I believe it. Yeah, it's the United Airlines, partly mm. operated by ANA. So that's a Nippon Airways. Uh, oh, so okay. I think the stop, yeah. uh, the layover will be at Narita. Yeah. Yeah, oh, we're gonna sweet. stop um, two stops actually. Oh, Narita. Uh, and... You're gonna stop at Narita and San Francisco. Ooh. So you're gonna fly on uh, on a 7 a.m. It says 22 hour flight, almost a day, almost a full a day. day. So you're gonna arrive the next day. I believe it's gonna be a, a Friday. Hmm. Uh, 22 hour flight, and you're gonna arrive in Las Vegas, Nevada, at two the next day. The, the flight back will be at 7 a.m. also from Nevada, Las Vegas, Nevada. Mm -hmm. And uh, two stops also at this time, the Los Angeles uh, International, LAX. Ooh. And then at Tokyo Narita. So you're gonna arrive in Kuala Lumpur uh, a, day, a day, 25 hours later. So this, the flight itself with this one is 4,345 ringgit. 4,345. Brain fart. And that's only the flight. I'm pretty sure that's gonna be like an add-on, like a luggage, oh, yeah. luggage and right. food, insurance, insurance, and stuff like that. So mm -hmm. it starts from four thousand three hundred, um, and then there. Are, <laughs> okay, there's a three thousand four here. Why is it so fucking cheap? It's by China Southern and mm. Alaska Airlines. They don't even have the logo on yeah, here. Yeah, that's two stop also. That's super dodgy, you're gonna, man. <laughs> you're gonna stop at Guangzhou and LAX. 35 hour flights, man. That's, ooh, that's like. 35 hour flights. <laughs> and the return is 24, 28 hours. So you're gonna mm. spend like a long time inside the cabin. Brain fart! Going down. <laughs> still, this is Malaysia Airlines plus United Airlines. Uh, also partly operated by ANA. Uh, again, it's 22 hour flight, 22 hour flight uh, on the way back but you're, you fly a bit later. Instead of 7 a.m., you fly at 5 p.m. This is a bit expensive. Uh, uh, it's probably because it's a later later flight, so it's 4,868. It's almost 5,000. 5,000. <laughs> and, and if we're scrolling down, there's a 5,000 buck. Oh. There's a 5,000 uh, buck flight there. 5,000 ringgit flight. Singapore Airlines and two stops. Most of them have two stops uh, for a flight at least 20 hours. We haven't seen like less than 20 hour flight. Yeah, they're all like 20, 20 hours and above. So mm -hmm. how about one way? One way, all right. So Kuala Lumpur to Nevada on the fifth of same same departure day. Mm -hmm. So search flights. Air Asia plus Xiamen Airlines and United uh, crap, that's Airlines. Like so you have three stops, twenty six hours worth of flight at two thousand two hundred and eighty eight. Hmm. I mean, about half what we were browsing just now. So we got Scoot, Xiamen Airlines, and United. All these three stops: Singapore, Xiamen, and finally at LAX. So Singapore, uh, Xiamen, and LAX. That, those are a yeah, lot of stops. So <laughs> three stops, guys. All starting from two thousand 
the cheapest here, 2275 Brain fart! Okay, so uh, aside from flight, obviously you wanted to check how much you need to bring. At least for Pocket the first- money. at least for <laughs> the first day. Uh, because you- Well, you're probably gonna bring some bakal. Knowing Malaysians, you're probably gonna bring your blachan and mm, whatever yeah. there. And Maggie, Maggie and yeah. Mino over there. So there's this- Most definitely. Yeah, this is a website I always uh, use. It's called Budget uh, Your Trip. Oh, Budget Your Trip? Yeah, you can just Google Ooh, okay. Budget Your Trip. And it'll be here. So it, it just uh, you know uh, averages like how much you have to s how much do you have to bring if you're at a, uh, uh, if you're traveling to a country for for a particular uh, duration. Ooh. So we're gonna just put here Las Vegas. We are not sponsored by Budget Your Trip. We are not sponsored by Budget Your Trip. Yeah. Brain fart. Oh, oh there there it is there yeah. it is Bring yeah it. there it is. Okay so Whoa. average okay travel style Poor what? Dear. you what can set your travel style to budget or mid-range or luxury high-end uh, let's, let's go for budget. budget budget okay cheap yeah cheap yeah okay you will need Ooh. at least 382 ringgit per day per over day. there in las vegas yeah and it shows you here one week you will need at least 2667 2, ringgit per for a one week for a person at a budget range brain fart yeah so it, it shows here like accommodation uh, oh, okay. at a hotel or hostel for one person. Yeah. All right. What's the difference here? And this is so convenient. Yeah, yeah. It shows you. But it just uh, shows you a rough estimation. Like, a, like an average. Uh, uh, like, uh, okay. You need to buy water there. Local transportation is at 53 ringgit. I think this is per day. Uh, entertainment is at 95 ringgit at a budget if you want to go to the casino. I don't know. Uh, so 95 ringgit per day. Bottled water. I think that's important. Also 11 ringgit per day. Uh, meals for one day at 103. Holy crap. I mean, if you bring your own Maggie, maybe not lot. But oh. I don't know. I don't know how the customs are over there. So mm. that's probably another story. Accommodations that uh, there are two choices here. Typical double occupancy room is at 399 ringgit, but hostel or hostel for one hotel or hostel for one person is at 197. And here's the thing. There's this one. The biggest number here is 400, 411 ringgit for scams, robberies, and mishaps. So you need to set aside that much. Holy crap. They so, even like give you a yeah. that, that possibility. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> so yeah, at least 382 <laughs> per day or 2,667 for a week stay. Yeah, but if you want to live there forever, I don't know if the aliens can help you print money, oh. maybe it would help you. We, we can fly away in their ship, yeah? Yeah, maybe you won't be in this planet anymore. Mm. Yeah. Brain fart. So we already have this is like if you're gonna be there for a week, it's mm -hmm. at least two six six seven plus the cheapest flight that we found, a one way flight is two two, two, two seven, seven five. five. So let's check out the calculator. Let's count real it quick. up. That's Ooh. at like four nine four two, four thousand nine hundred and forty two. So around so five thousand. That's five thousand. You might wanna hike it up to at least six thousand to be uh, Safe. comfortable, uh -huh. perhaps. Brain fart. To go there, one way flight. <laughs> And save and the aliens. To, to save here. <laughs> so you need 6,000 bucks to go to, at least to head over to Nevada. Not yet Area 51. <laughs> because obviously, yet, <laughs> obviously, you need to find out where that is. I mean, I know it's on Google Maps. It's searchable, right? Ooh, I don't know, is, is it? it? I don't know. Whoa. Maybe. Okay. Brain fart! Believe. 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 Believe this guy say. Believe. So 6,000. <laughs> 6,000 bucks at least for a one-way trip. And the mission to save the aliens. Save the aliens. Yeah. And the cute anime cat girls inside cute as well. Anime cat girls. Yeah. So hope that helps. <laughs> hope that helps. And uh, don't don't get back to us if if things go wrong. <laughs> We're just trying to help. Yeah. Yeah. At least to set you on the set you on the right path. Which flights to look at. How much you have to set aside. Yeah. We will see you at the raid. Right, Azman? I'll be here. <laughs> if you want to go, you go. Yeah. But See you guys at the read. <laughs> That's I, I'm dragging you along as well. We, we're going. I, you got six bucks. Hey, six thousand bucks. <laughs> well, I can probably set aside six thousand bucks for myself, but can you? Uh, I was hoping a, a no noise space can sponsor us or something. Brain fart. Anyways. <laughs> That's episode mm -hmm. three. Hopefully, it's an informative one. 
Uh, we'll see you on the next episode. We thank you so much. And uh, don't forget to like, subscribe, comment, like or dislike, doesn't matter. Uh, as long as there's engagement on our, on our channel. Yes. So we'll see you on the next episode. Talk this, to us. Yeah, talk to us. Or on, on YouTube or yeah. talk to us in person, whatever, it doesn't matter. Yeah. So whatever <laughs> it is, have a nice day. Brain fart. Thanks for watching our show. Hope you guys like it. Do hit subscribe and like our stuff. And have, have a, a nice, nice day. day.